This is the super easy, super quick, no BS hard drive upgrade for the 2012-2013 Mac Mini. This is a base model. If you watch all YouTube videos on upgrading your Mac Mini, they are a lie. If you want to add a second hard drive, you do need to take out and remove the logic board to a small degree. But to ignore all the YouTube videos on upgrading your hard drive, the base model comes with a 500 gigabyte 5400 RPM Hitachi hard drive. Now this of course easily comes out but we're not adding a second hard drive. All Mac Minis come with the second slot for a second hard drive. But if you're adding an additional hard drive, this is not mine, mine was upgraded to a two terabyte single two and a half inch hard drive, but I'm adding a one terabyte upgrade. Now I use the free program Super Duper to clone the original hard drive here to the original hard drive being a 500 gigabyte to the one terabyte uh, Hitachi. Now there only has to be uh, six screws removed. Once you take the back cover off, which twists off by hand, you need to remove the three screws for the fan, remove the fan, the one screw for the cowling, and then the two screws for the Wi-Fi antenna grate. Now these two screws are also supporting the hard drive. You'll notice the uh, factory hard drive is actually held in upside down. These two screws hold it to the back end of the casing and these two screw holes are what is supporting the two and a half inch hard drive from the inside. So it's being held over here by the casing and by the Wi-Fi grate here. Otherwise it would actually fall down. Once you remove the Wi-Fi grate you can actually push down on the hard drive. The memory doesn't need to be removed at all either. The only reason they have the memory out on this unit is because I'm upgrading the memory. So you only have, uh, excuse me, uh, six screws that need to be removed. Three for the fan, one for the cowling, and two for the, um, the Wi-Fi grate. Now this is the best, other than a memory upgrade, the best, cheapest way to upgrade your base model mini. Now what you do, the, now t all Toshiba 2.5 inch hard drives are made by Hitachi, so ignore the Toshiba name. You can go at the Best Buy or you can order one online. Now this, inside this casing, this is a USB uh, 2 terabyte 5400 RPM Toshiba. It's made by Hitachi. The hard drive side on, size in this is 15.2 millimeters thickness. Your standard 500 gigabyte or 1 terabyte drives are 9.5 millimeter. Now the Mac Mini will support two of these. A Mac Mini server has actually two of these. You can actually insert two of these. Now it doesn't matter since this is 15.2 millimeters. Since this will take two 9.5 millimeter hard drives sticking in a one 15.2 millimeter 2 terabyte hard drive is not a problem. It will sit in there fine. If you want to stick a rubber grommet underneath there, that's fine. Now you can get these at uh, Best Buy for $119. You take a screwdriver, Google, I mean, go on YouTube and research it. Take uh, this plastic casing apart and inside is a standard 2.5 uh, inch uh, laptop hard drive, but it is rather thick. Instead of 9.5 millimeters thick, it is 15.2 millimeters thick, which is no problem. It will go in there exactly fine. You remove your proprietary SATA cable off your factory Mac Mini hard drive and stick it on your 2 terabyte. although this is another person's hard drive, another person's Mac Mini that I'm upgrading only to a one terabyte. But for 119 you take out your 500 gig or sell it on eBay, buy your 2 terabyte and stick it in there. You will have, uh, whether you upgrade the memory or not is up to you, although that is the number one most important upgrade. But for $119 you can take your base model Mac Mini and upgrade it to a 2 terabyte. Now you stick in 8 gig or 16 gig of RAM and you've got uh, a two terabyte or one terabyte drive in there, uh, most people will not upgrade the hard drive on the Mac Mini because to them, they watch the videos and it's too daunting. All the videos you see on YouTube are complete BS. You do not have to stick uh, your tool in here and actually pull, retract out the logic board and you do not have to take or dis uh, disconnect the power cable or the IR board at all 
to upgrade your hard drive on your 2012 or 2013 Mac Mini. You do not have to do that. All the videos you'll see on YouTube show them ultimately removing the IR connector and the power cable and sliding the, the logic board out some so you can actually stick in either two hard drives. But in this case, you're only replacing one hard drive with another hard drive. So that does not have to be done. So the only thing that has to be removed is the fan with the three screws, the cowling with the one screw, and the two screws holding the Wi-Fi grate, which are also supporting the factory hard drive. So for $119, or sometimes as cheap as $105, You've got an upgrade from 500 gigabytes to 2 terabytes, or you can throw in a 1 terabyte drive if you want. And the notion of the Mac Mini is complicated to fully take apart, but doing this upgrade literally takes, even with a person with no computer skills at all, as far as upgrading memory or you know changing out hard drive, this is extremely fast and extremely easy. Um, I've gotten to the point now where I can do it in about eight minutes. For your first time, you should not have any difficulty at all doing it in no more than 20 minutes. And the only thing you need is a T8 and a T6 uh, screw set to uh, completely take everything apart. Now, you also don't need a plastic tool to lift up your SATA connector right here, the factory hard drive. Right here, you do not use want to use a metal tool. This is a plastic toothpick from a Swiss Army knife uh, kit, but any sort of thin plastic tool to lift that SATA connector up. And once you install your new hard drive, just pop it back in with your finger and uh, watch the other YouTube videos as far as taking apart the fan, work in reverse order, the cowling with its one screw, which is super simple, and uh, your uh, Wi-Fi grate. After that, you're done. You've got a uh, upgraded Mac Mini that's uh, completely upgraded to uh, either a one terabyte or 1.5 terabyte or two terabyte uh, hard drive and uh, super easy, super simple, super quick and also super cheap. So this is the best super easy, ultra fast, easy greasy way to upgrade your Mac Mini from a 500 gigabyte on the base model to a 1.5 terabyte or a two terabyte drive. Like I said, you can either get these on Amazon.com, they say Toshiba, but they're made by Hitachi. All two and a half inch Toshiba drives are made by Hitachi. Now this is a two terabyter, and um, I've actually cracked one of these open. All you need is a little pry tool, and uh, remove the SATA connector on the inside of this. This is uh, for a USB external, but inside you have an internal two and a half inch hard drive, and it's two terabytes. You pop it in here real quick. Put your Mac Mini back together, you turn it on, you've got a 2TB hard drive. Thanks so much.